A happy New Year, everyone. I'm Naomi. Today, I'm gonna make ozoni, Japanese New Year mochi soup. There are numerous variety of ozoni in Japan, depends on the region and household. But roughly speaking, there are two kinds: the Kanto style and Kansai style. Today, I'm gonna show you the Kansai style white miso-based mochi soup. Now, let's get started. Here's today's hero ingredient, mochi. Today's mochi is this round, disc-like shaped one. This is essential for Kansai style ozoni. For your information, these are rectangular shaped mochi for Kanto style. This round shape evokes the Japanese phrase enman, which means as living in harmony and peace. Microwave for 30 seconds to soften the center of mochi. Prepare dashi stock made from kondo seaweed and katsuo bonito flake. Please refer to my previous video if you are interested in how to make dashi from scratch. Today, I'm gonna cook with my handmade white sweet miso. This is my family's tradition. Grandma used to make a large amount of it on the beginning of December and distribute it to all of our family members. I learned the recipe from her and I'll show you how to make it in the near future, so please look forward to it. White miso ozoni should be super smooth, so grind lumps of koji and beans in miso. Koji is edible fungus which is source of savory. If you are curious about koji, please watch my previous video, Fried Chicken Recipe with Shio Koji. Of course, you can use a commercially available sweet miso as well. Add daikon slices and a miso, then turn on to medium-low heat. When the water comes to a boil, turn down to low heat and add mochi. Then cook gradually until the mochi gets softened and the soup becomes smooth and thick. Sprinkle bonito flakes on top. How did you like it? Today, I introduce my familiar taste from my childhood, white miso based ozoni. To be honest with you, in my family, we put mochi only as an ingredient for ozoni. It's very simple and beautiful because it's just white mochi and white miso. There is no set rule to make ozoni, so you can be playful and enjoy arranging your favorite ingredients and make your original ozoni as you like. I wish you all the best and a good health in 2021. Thank you for supporting me all the time. I look forward to working with you. So thank you guys for watching and see you next time.
Bye.